Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of Hearts of Iron 4, Ensig and Italy. So two things before we begin, one of them being, sorry I'm late, I ate dinner and time just flew away, so I forgot about the time. Honestly, I'm sorry. Second thing, uh, god damn it guys, it's your fault I'm playing Italy again. I read all your comments and um, I think three of you, I hope I really didn't miss anyone, wrote a couple of super nice stories, like letters from the front line, uh, liberate, like tons of different, well, I think one guy's writing to his, like, his family, one guy's writing to his like lover or girlfriend, wife, something, and some guys are just talking about the front life, and it's like, it's really, really awesome. Holy shit, I actually got chills, like real, honest, like, uh, like I got chills when I read it, I was like, shit. You're actually making these people human to me right now, which is bad. Because I know I'm gonna have to throw in so many of them to their death. Like, stop making them... Like, I need to do something with all of your stories. Like, I really... Like, I think it's awesome that you do. I love them. I, like... I think I've clearly expressed right now how much I like them, but... Please continue with this, and I, I need to make something about it. Like, I need to get some kind of storyline, some kind of... I don't know, some something to, like, bring it up and make a separate video of it once I'm done. Or something. Like, you made it impossible for me to not finish this campaign right now. Some way, somehow, we are gonna finish this, no matter what happens. And... Uh, God damn it, guys. It's really, really awesome. I hope you continue doing this. I love them. So, um... Was there anything else? I don't think so. Just keep it up, guys. I, I love it. And I, I hope you like this campaign and will like the continuation. Which might suddenly turn a hell of a lot better. Because if we turn to the other top rated comment was Venice is empty. So we're just gonna try to rush in right here. None of these units are trying to move down. So we're just gonna rush in right here and hopefully grab it for ourselves. That would be so freaking awesome if we managed to grab Venice. Like, that would be ridiculously good. The only thing I see as very, very worrying is we have, like, five divisions, five divisions, five divisions, five, 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 five. Like, there's five divisions on every single front line right there. That's way too little. Uh, I'm gonna grab every single one of these tanks and just assign here. No matter if we have bad supply or whatever, we can't hold the front line with that few units. So every single one of you are gonna move forward right here and just accept the losses. Because we can't compare with them one to one. I clearly noticed that before, and now we're not close to one to one. We are less than one to one. So we're gonna have to eat those attrition losses. That's just how it is. Uh, otherwise, I think we're fully done. We can pick another one right here. Let's see. Better weapons, better weapons. And I think it's time to unpause. I'm gonna go slowly right here just to make sure that nothing happens right here. God damn it, you assigned a unit right here. Can we attack you? Can we break you? No, those fourth levels are way too high. And, and yeah, yeah, stop attacking right there. Don't die. Just don't die right here. And you guys, you're gonna split right now up alongside the entire front line. We're just gonna have to sit and relax right now because this is looking kind of worrying, at least for me. Uh, let's, yeah, that's good. Hopefully it's just fine it's, and I won't have to have another story about how the entire front line fell. Uh, never mind. Um, guys, if you can move up right there, that would be awesome. And I think I'm gonna pull two units right there and pull units, two units right over there. Uh, shit, yeah, we're falling right there. We're falling right there. Uh, both of you move in right there. Take one unit from there. And just reinforce this by everything we got. And uh, they attack me. Yeah, otherwise we seem to be holding. And if we manage to hold all of this, then we will be victorious. Like, basically what's happening is exactly kind of what you wanted. Me... To just sit back and relax a bit more and let them attack me. So let's just hope I don't fall because this is losing very, very quickly. Oh, come on, guys. How quick? In six hours you're going to arrive. Okay, that's that's good enough, I think. These guys are moving into their front line positions. Very good. But other way, up, 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 up. Now we're losing right here. But we are getting more reinforcements over there. Uh, if everyone... Oh, we can't do force defense. Damn it. Um, you guys need to strategically deploy right there. Come on. Get up right there. 
Thank you. Uh, so we're gonna fall back right there. I guess we're just gonna have to do it. Uh, let's do a um, manual one so we, that we actually have control over to make sure that we actually fall back properly rather than some kind of desperate fallback that we can't handle. Uh, let's take two divisions right there. Okay, only one tank division apparently, but yeah. Let's just assign some more stuff right there. Or we should actually fall back from there. Fa let's fall back from there. One, ta one unit right there and two, come on. All of you guys. Fall back right there, okay, except half of you are gonna go back right there. Okay, cool. So we're gonna have to fall back on a couple of places right now. Come on, go in right here and reinforce the proper places. We can't hold it for much longer. We are, oh god, the supply right here is horrid. That's probably one of the big reasons they're completely crushing us right now. Uh, weren't you guys falling back? I think you were. Okay, there we go. Uh, this is looking extremely bad because they have like 20 units right here. That's way too much. That's way, way, way too much right now. Uh, we can't pick anything just yet, at least. And this guy should probably be replaced with the other guy. But we can't do anything just now. It's still going to be on route, so I'd rather have a good commander than none. And they're just pushing us back right now. We can't do anything about it. Uh, these guys need to get in right there. I know you have bad supply right here, or I know there's bad supply on the front line, but I can't deal with that right now. We're gonna have to just accept it. And they're actually pushing us back right here as well. Are you kidding me? Are they gonna push us back? We might actually have to fall back this entire way. Fall back the entire way. Hello darkness, my old friend. It's time to fall back once again. Every single one of you guys, get back right here. Well, except you 15, of course. You're gonna stay exactly where you are. No, I only wanted you those 15, please. And these 15, stay, stay where you are. Just fall back. Fall back. Fall back. They have broken through. The castle is breached. Retreat. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Come on, get back right there, every single one of you. We need this river, and you guys fall back please over there. And uh, we have seven divisions coming right there. Uh, guys, come on, strategically deploy back. Just fall back please, thank you. 31 divisions right there, so we can take 15 and strategically deploy behind right here. So you will actually shuffle around a, mo a lot more. Apparently not, so I'm gonna have to f really, really, come on, this battle need to end, so I can actually shuffle those units around. Uh, take two divisions from there, just in case, spare divisions, and these guys are, wow, we're, they're really just crushing us right now. Are you kidding me? Is this gonna be my, or is this gonna be my episode I was so excited to record? Me losing. What the hell happened? What the hell happened? Did he suddenly just turn on their AI or something. This is crazy. Uh, strategic deploy right there and then you can, well, redeploy from there. Come on, attack right there, delay them, do not let them push in right there. Take a couple divisions, attack right there. We need to break them, we need to push them away from my, well, from my river defensive positions. Come on, break that. There we go, good. Now we might be able to hold my line. Nope, nope, they are of course pushing in right over here. Come on, so we deploy right there and just get in there. Uh, we have a couple of divisions moving in right there, good. Now this should be a proper front line again. I hope. Come on, speed up right now and just let people reshuffle. We're not gonna do anything offensively until everyone have knows, knows their place, basically. God, this is actually horrible, the supply right here. Uh, why are, don't we have more units over there, please? I'm gonna have to probably reshuffle everything myself. Okay, you guys at least moving properly. Oh my god, really? We are pushed back the entire way right there. Everything we had gained, we're lost. Every single province we gained over the past two episodes we lost within seconds for nothing at all we could do nothing about this
I'm devastated. What the hell happened? And now they're nuking my units as well. <laughs> yeah, like they weren't bad enough supply. Oh my god. Um, I, I'm no longer as happy. <laughs> I don't want to read next. I want. I. I. I really like it. Liked your stories, when they're about my glorious push forward and how everything is turning better. Somehow I doubt that's what's gonna be the main headlines anymore. What the hell happened? I could do nothing to stop it. What the hell happened? <laughs> I'm a bit stunned. Like, what? <laughs> we held them. We pushed them back. We we had no real issues. And then my front line broke. Completely. Uh, what the hell happened with the division standing right there? You guys are... Oh, did we mess up? Maybe we did. Uh, that's not supposed to, well actually you were supposed to be in you know I think but now I'm gonna sign you guys right there instead <sighs> what happened this was this was gonna be my <laughs> this was gonna be my I take Venice and we begin our push back episode not mine not my we are back where we started episode. Sure, now they're taking attrition, but horrible attrition for no bloody ass reason. No glorious push forward known, reconquest of my home territory. We just simply lost everything we had gained. Can we somehow push them back now, maybe? I doubt it, that supply penalty is huge. Okay, not as big as it can be, but still big enough for matter to matter. Quite a bit. I'm gonna make my next push with infant divisions. They at least have stuff. No, no, that's also bad. Like, I don't know what to do. Uh, 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 like, I had my mindset on a certain type of episode. But, like, I don't think I miscalculated this badly ever they just went in and crushed us give me my give me four tank divisions please unselect two of the come on unselect you and you make a new front line under a new well the same commander as before please and your order is to, well, right now I know at least where to focus. I should focus on Milan. And... Well, actually, I don't know if I should focus on Milan. I think I'm gonna try focus on Milan, but we'll see. Everyone, split in half, get over right there. We barely have command power, so we can... We cannot try this indefinitely. Let's do some war propaganda against Soviet Union. We should have done desperate defense, of course. Holy shit. But I doubt that would have actually helped enough. But still, what the hell happened? <laughs> we just simply broke. We simply broke. We have very high stability now, but... <laughs> I don't know what to do. I, I don't know, I, I, it might be silly, but what the fuck happened? We, we still have Genoa you know, at least, so it's a slight push here in the west. But we lost our entire push forward and, uh, and my entire confidence. Yeah, these six divisions, they are very much needed, but where the hell, where, where are they going to be placed? Not here. Like... The infrastructure right here is just destroyed. And they're messing up with my infrastructure right here. We can't like... We can't focus our... That was supposed to be my one hope. 
we were gonna be fine. I was gonna capture some more civilian factories and then everything was gonna be great. Come on, deploy those guys now. So you stop complaining about it. I'm gonna assign you to a separate army. You're gonna be under that guy and just help cleaning up these things. You do have maintenance company, right? Yes. Then please just go in and kill them. Basically a separate army to just clean up stuff, I think, is gonna be the most important thing. So here, so the <laughs> Spanish are still trying to do something. Did they really leave a province open right here? No, just, yeah, shuffling stuff. I kind of want to retry that intro now <laughs> because I, I'm completely lost. What the hell are we supposed to do if they can just push us back that easily? They're trying to attack us a slight bit here now, but we do need to somehow go in and break Milan and Salo at the same time. We need in. Hello, two divisions. You are not going to be here at all. You are going to wait for them to mess up. You're going to wait for them to mess up, and then we're going to go in and crush them. Those two divisions are going to go straight. Oh, well, those two are going to go right there. These two are going to go straight over there. We're going to wait for a mess up, and then we're going to go in and take Salo and Milan at the same time. We're just waiting now. Portugal wants to send two divisions. I accept every single one of your divisions. Uh, logistic company, we finally have it. And then we're going to go in and replace... What the hell are we going to replace? Field hospital? That's a lot of soft attack. I guess you're just gonna take more losses. That's a decent negative right there. Or you are gonna have all your firepower I can possibly get. Where's my infantry templates? Change to this. You are my infantry template. God, is this my infantry template? <laughs> Support anti tank guns. I've, how crucial is that? Really freaking crucial. Yeah. Otherwise you have no piercing. Support artillery, that's kind of crucial as well. If I did something like this instead, then we're 21 combat with. Should I care about combat with right now? I don't know, I don't think so, honestly. Could we change to that? Could we actually change to 22 combat with? It's gonna cost me, well, it's, it's really only artillery. It cost me less manpower to do this. And then we're gonna change this guy to a logistics guy, which is gonna move this by 0.13. We don't have enough artillery for it right now. And that's only with one extra. Oh my god, I even made a mistake right there. If we do this, then you lose a lot of your firepower right now. But if we want to keep our supply somewhat intact, I guess we're just going to have to take less losses somehow. That's the only way I see it's even, f even close to fe feasible. Yeah, that's a lot better, but it's not enough. We are gonna get more. We're definitely gonna get more. We need to be more, much more careful with all our attacks. Reduce the supply everywhere, please. Every piece of supply you take is super, super crucial right now. Uh, do we have anyone right here that could possibly help with something? Doctor Quartermaster. This maybe. Uh, left wing support, this is just different support guys, yeah. Propaganda, we are large investment, well, I, c I guess we could always go to minimal, but that would just destroy our units, but, well, not that that would matter. Uh, limited export, do we, like, do we have enough for what we want? Yes. But we are not building anything, so we could technically go up to free trade. Uh, just to get that factory output, construction speed output, and research time. We don't need our factories right now. We can always change that again. So we're definitely gonna switch that to free trade. Yes, we get that extra factory output. That's something at least. Uh, and there we go, another nuke on Rome. And then followed up by an invasion. Oof, this is not looking good. This is not looking good at all. And now we're not producing anything anymore. 
they just they basically picked up their nuking speed and now I can't do anything to defend myself. They can basically nuke me into the ground. Oh my god. And now Romanian units are on the front line, really? Like I needed more enemies. Uh, let's see, night attack, hard attack. Just bump up the soft attack even more, I guess. Is this my time? Is this my time? No, it's way too many units right there. Is this my time? Two tanks right there. So maybe. Can you attack right there? No. You are alone in that attack then. Because you guys can't attack right there. This province is the one we have to break. Take those tanks, take those tanks. I'm gonna do a slight test right now. How quickly could, would we actually destroy them? Nope, nope, not anymore. As soon as it went back, just stop it, stop it. Stop it instantly. How many men did we lose right there? 6,000 men. Could you somehow break that? I doubt it. Well, yeah, stop doing it then. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Anti-air guns, we're almost running out of. Anti-tank guns are empty. I'm gonna have to reduce it right here by double. And that won't barely make a difference right there. From deficient reinforcements, yeah. We're losing more and more. I might have to restart this campaign. <laughs> Like, I, I simply, or may restart at least this episode. Maybe we can hold off. I'm gonna make a save right now. <laughs> there we go, we have a save. I'm gonna go back to the save we've begun with this episode and see if we can do anything else. And hello, their, their counter. Oh my god, really? Oh no, I was, I'm trying to find the fail counter right there. Hello there, counter. As well, it was a long count, long time coming. No, really, I just want to see had the desperate defense thing done any difference at all. As soon as you attack me, then we need to do something. Actually, before now, maybe m with the extra entrenchment, it would have been possible. But I doubt it. I doubt one single province were gonna make enough of a difference. Actually, hold this. If we counterattacked, would that have helped somehow? No, not really. Wow, they are just slaughtering us. So they break us right here, and then with that province, they will continue just slaughtering us. Right? Yeah. They're breaking us right there, and I had breaking us right. Okay, it would have been no difference. Okay, I had that cleared right now. I just needed to see that. I just needed to see that we wouldn't have been able to survive just by me picking an event option. <sighs> okay, there we go. I'm gonna remove the fail counter now because, well, we're going back to where we were. We're going back to where we were and we're gonna see if we can do anything. Oh my god. How could we do it? How can we change? How can we make something that should be impossible possible? We need to go further. We need to go to the possible. <laughs> Ugh. Those goddammit Soviet divisions. Come on, just move along right there. Move along right there. I'm gonna charge in right there. Could we break that? Very much that single division, very much the next division joining in as well. But can we actually push through right here now? They just keep reinforcing with more and more divisions and I can't. I simply can't take those extra losses like they can. <laughs> we have 3% war propaganda right now. At least that's something. And they just keep nuking me in every single province where something might, might happen. Something... Everything I have is destroyed. Every road, every city, every factory, 
And as soon as something gets repaired, it's once again destroyed. And there we go, destroyed instantly by bombers. So they're... Attack right there, see if we can break them. Break them somewhere so we can have some victory. Uh, these guys are now moving in, or trying at least. Take three divisions from there. And you guys can attack right there in the south. If if west is the only way we can go, then west we will go. Because every time I push in, right, I like I decided not to push further west because it served no real tactical purpose. We're not reaching any new lands, we're not reaching any new factories, we're barely reaching more manpower. But if this is the only way we can push, then west we'll go. For as long as we can. Spread out our front line more, get supply, whatever. Whatever it is. This was a province that stopped us last time. Will it stop us again? Probably. <laughs> let's assign these guys right here and let's pick the other commander. You're gonna have 15 days I can't use, but all of the bonuses you have, all the reductions in supply, I need you at the front line right now. I need you now. I'm gonna grab a couple of these divisions, throw you in right there so you can actually reinforce this so you have at least four divisions on every single one of these stuff. Right there, right there, and right there. Thank you, that's gonna help a tiny bit right there. We're still holding them right here alongside this entire front line, yeah. I'm gonna grab, let's see, five divisions from here. Or four divisions apparently, and just assign right here north. Uh, you don't wanna move because, well, not enough supply. Well, I don't care. You're gonna move in anyway. Disperse industry, thank you, but well, I doubt it's gonna help, actually help me right now. Uh, cons next construction level, that's, well, it's probably not gonna help me either. We're doing construct repair. Like, I'm gonna squeeze out everything we can from this nation. We are gonna, let's see. Are these good provinces for them to actually be let in? That's seven. This one I'm gonna let in. And make sure that we just kick the crap out of them later. But the other guys, oh damn it, we actually broke them before I had the time. I was gonna let them in and then, well, kick their ass. I, there's no port, nothing right here, nothing they will cut off, so yes, let them in right there, then kill them. Have the correct um, uh, commander arrived right now. And you are gonna be arriving, well, at the end of that day. Cool. You're right here now. That should fix the supply a tiny bit. Yeah, just a tiny, tiny, tiny bit. There, he has a better modifier right here over 8. So, okay. We got that going for us. These guys are gonna be assigned right here. Uh, all right, I could actually stole in them rather than four divisions from the su southern army. Uh, let's just assign these guys like that instead. So in case of them joining up right here again, then we let them in, then we kill them with those six divisions. And you're attacking me right here close to Rome, but yeah, that won't work. And they apparently took Genoa from us right now. Oh, right, because we never we didn't assign the extra divisions that we need, of course, for this. Uh, they need to be pushed back instantly. Thank you. At least that worked. Okay, uh, we're going to have to take this division, assign right... Just walk in right there. No, uh, to you guys. And get in there. You need to definitely have the entrenchment trait. What the hell, Daniel? So, yeah, we wasted some more very, very valuable points right there. And you are going to join him right there. Come on, there you know, uh, get troops right there, please. And we're gonna steal one division from there as well. Assign those guys, thank you. It seems like they're spreading out a tiny bit better right now. Let's see, can we push even further west? Uh, it looks like an area right here. We're breaking that division, we're gonna leave at least two divisions on each of these provinces because two divisions are still enough for me to be able to reshuffle something else. It might work. Uh, they're leaving a lot of provinces right there. Please try to move in right there as well. And then we're going to take two divisions from there, attacking from the south while we move in up here. Maybe, maybe, maybe we can reach this city. We reach this city. We're basically paying for those logistics companies with l Italian lives right now. 
and yeah that was a failure let's see how many men did we lose right there six thousand men and five thousand right there that's more than we can afford honestly but we can't do it any other way right now we can't pay it with equipment we can't pay it with soviet equipment we need to do it with italian lives We are falling back, we are still standing strong. I refuse to accept anything else than total victory really now. We are going to get our revenge. We are going to come back. People of Milan got their got the feel for freedom. And, well, Italian hands again. We are going to make sure they once again embrace it. And there we go, another nuke right there. But we got another level of logistic company, which is just going to improve everything we're sacrificing even more right now. We have supplies in the west, or in the east right now. Or, well, close to full supply in the east. We're going to let them embrace freedom once again. Soon enough. But first, we have a little date with destiny. Move in right here, take this province. And we're only one province away from there. Come on. Streamline manufacturing, I don't bloody care about you. Unless it actually meant streamline population production or something. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna take... Okay, we're still holding quite well now. Could we take these guys and actually break this, prob break this guy? That's a fort I would love to own right now. Um, but I'm not gonna sacrifice that many men for that. So, at least, at least our werewolf guerrillas, my people, the people have not given up. Resistance everywhere. <laughs> oh, God damn it. Um, anything else I can do? Um, decryption right there, more res and decryption, please. Anything that may might be able to help us. Uh, dangerous naval invasion in Italy. Well, we're still holding right there, so that's the important part. Uh, oh shit, actually a pretty large naval invasion right here. I'm gonna take two divisions, move in from there, and just break it all. Because you don't have any equipment, which, well, you don't have any supply, which means bye bye. Just take them down. Just move in and bring them down. And this episode is very late right now, very late, and it's already supposed to be, well, it's already been half an hour so I'm just gonna take these two divisions right there I'm gonna take two divisions from there to kill that division and we're just gonna finish this off before we end so I don't have any weird mechs going on of course wh why the hell not why the hell not with some more enemies I don't care and of course you're now invading that less weakened port right over there there we go killed off and you guys can now return Return there, you are returning right there. And thank you guys for actually, uh, god damn it, let's see if we can actually make this happen. You're gonna retreat, you're gonna land. Now you can actually, no, try to normally move back right there. You are arriving right there, we're gonna take these six divisions and attack straight there. That's your only goal and objective from being right there. You're gonna go in and crush whatever unit that actually arrives right there. Thank you, done. Thank you guys for watching this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed this episode and you like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye and bye.